investigators. That's not crime scene tape. It's caution tape. The manhole? I don't take advice from tape. What do we have here? Hostage situation. Don't move, or I'll eat it. That's not your Butterfinger. Oh, yeah? Well, my mouth says it is. Mouths say a lot of things. Stay back. I'm warning you. OK. Go ahead. I dare you. OK. All right. Wait, no. I was using reverse psychology. Please don't. Oh. Yeah! Ooh, yummy Butterfinger. You've had enough. I played it by the book. There is no book for this. I was writing one. I just keep playing it back over and over again. Then I notice something. No one eats like that guy. Ooh, yummy Butterfinger. I don't care how much you like something. He's faking. He's acting. Maybe it's connected. To what? A Butterfinger shipment was hacked. A whole warehouse of Butterfinger bars stolen. When? Right when this guy started making a big fuss. What does your gut tell you? I think he has something to do with it. What does your gut tell you? What it always does. Have another Butterfinger. It was all an act, wasn't it? Of course. A diversion while somebody hacked a Butterfinger shipment. I don't know what you mean. Who are you working for? I work for myself. I'm an actor. Not a very good one. I book a few roles. Webisodes, I bet. Talk to me when you're on the network. You want to play hardball? I didn't want to have to do this. Huh? Okay, look, I was sent out on a Butterfinger commercial. The script said that I should steal a Butterfinger and then pretend to eat it when BFI arrived. Then when you came, I thought the director wanted improv. No director with this salt and courage is improv. Unless the actors are really talented.